Okay, this is uh, in response to a question that I saw about um, using an external 24 volt power supply uh, in conjunction with a Cohesion 3D Mini controller um, without an external Z or A axis right now. And there is documentation about adding an external power supply in the Z axis edition documentation but you have to read pretty far down so um here's here's what's going on so normally uh with the included directions for the cohesion 3d you're going to take the power cable that went to the oem controller which should be a, a m2 nano um, and just connect it right here on the cohesion it's plug and play so the deal is, uh, this person wants to use an external 24 volt uh, power supply to run all the motion control instead of using the stock K40. So the stock K40 is only tasked with firing the laser and running the electronics on the control panel and that type thing. Uh, and taking the extra burden of the motion control and steppers and all that stuff off of the power supply. So go ahead and connect the... Uh, as per the directions uh, on the cohesion site for the 3d mini and once you get it installed that way install your additional or secondary 24 volt power supply and get line in going to it and what you want to do is on the connector that runs from the k40 to here you want to sever the 24 volt line you just want to cut it at one end or the other or in the middle or somewhere leave the ground because you need continuity between ground on both power supplies um, you do not want to connect both 24 volt power supplies and have the positive 24 volts uh, in series or parallel for that matter so you definitely need to sever this connection between the k40 power supply um, and the cohesion 3d after you do that you run the power out the 24 volt positive and ground from your external power supply to these two connections here plus 24 and ground so you will have a continuity to ground here because you left your ground alone you did not sever it over here on the stock k40 uh, cable so that will make it so that both power supplies reference the same ground and prevent any problems firing the laser. And now you have effectively taken the 24 volt output of the K40 and just stopped it. You're just not even using it. Just cut it off right at the connector if you want. Uh, and now your entire motion control and your Cohesion 3D is being powered through these two terminals here, these screw terminals by your external 24 volt power supply. I hope that helps.